Trust me, it's pretty good. Janet here. Something um, has come into our lives. Oh. Bang! <laughs> All right, general knowledge. It's called the brown what? Dina. No hair, which metallic? Posh in a scummy way. Yeah. Yeah, you sit tight. You wait. <laughs> Don't pull me. Oh, there's the pee dog there. This vlog's really boring. Where the hell have you been? Somebody said that to me in my Instagram. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. It's vlog time. I suppose we've got a bit of explaining to do. Explain yourself. Apologies. Long story short, we got really sick uh, just after Christmas and we wanted to put a vlog out last week but it got pushed back a week because we were genuinely really, really ill. I think there's something there was something going around, chest infections, ear infections, sinus infections. Let me know what infection you got over Christmas. We were absolutely dying, but we're back. And um, this is what a man who has hardly showered for the last three and a half weeks looks like. Um, but today that's all changing. I'm having a haircut, trimming my beard, and uh, we're getting back on this vlog horse. So yeah, we were very, very sick. Not just like, oh, I feel a bit, I don't feel very well. Actual sort of bones aching, can't really move, shivering, sweating. Um, it's been awful. Uh, which does actually segue quite nicely into this week's sponsor. This vlog is brought to you by Surfshark VPN. So as I say, we've spent a lot of time in bed and it's not, you know, not, it's not like that. But it's, um... <laughs> so when you're lying in bed and you've watched everything on television and you need some other stuff to watch to keep you entertained while you're not feeling very well, um, Surfshark VPN came to the rescue. Surfshark VPN also lets you digitally... <laughs> Come on, James, digitally what? Surfshark VPN also lets you digitally trick the internet <laughs> into thinking you're in a completely different country. Your moustache is hanging so far over your top lip. Uh, it's awful. So yeah, I switched on my Surfshark VPN, told the internet that my iPad was actually in America, and I got to watch all of the American catalogue of Netflix and stuff like that, which really did keep me going. Um, so thank you very much Surfshark VPN. And luckily enough, Surfshark have an amazing deal for the At Home with the Buckleys viewers. If you click the link in the description and use promo code the Buckleys, you will get 83% off and three months extra for free. That's right, for free! That's right, it's free fitting. <laughs> if you click the link in the description and use promo code the Buckleys, <laughs> trust me, it's free fitting! Why? <laughs> Shit. Because that's what he did, he was like proper like, kind of mental. <laughs> So thank you very much Surfshark VPN for sponsoring this vlog. Now it's time, it is time, the time is, the time is upon us. I'm gonna have a haircut, I'm gonna trim my beard, and I'm gonna see you uh, when I'm looking a bit more presentable. Two weeks into the new year. <laughs> Hi, uh, longer than that, isn't it? What's the date? Saturday the 14th. It's the 14th. Two weeks, exactly two weeks. Hey, we can start this vlog properly now. Now that I'm... Now that the star of the show is here. What? Because I've had a shave and stuff and now I look like the star I'm back. Of the show. Hey. Hi. Have you, have you been? Good, how are you? God, I haven't seen you for ages. We don't, um... You might not know this, but we're actually uh, actors. Yeah. This whole thing has been a, a scripted experiment that we did. <laughs> um, Janet here, who <laughs> plays uh, Claire Buckley. Yeah. Um, I've known you since uh, drama school. We went to yeah. drama school together, didn't we? Yeah. 
Um, my name's Sean Carlson, <laughs> and I play James Buckley on At Home with the Buckleys. <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> it's been a tough couple of years doing this. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's taken its toll. Hey, it's been absolutely fine. My um, husband um, thinks the casting is terrible. He's just jealous. <laughs> Should we start again? Yeah. Oh, we're back. We're back. We're here. You're there. Everything's back to normal at last. Claire? Yes. What have you been up to since <laughs> uh, just post Christmas? Um, I've been coughing, shivering, just feeling like <laughs> in general. Yeah, this is the first week. I'm gonna put that, these lights on. This is the first week that the um, the pair of us have felt. <laughs> Do we not have any electricity? Yeah. Right now, I need to turn it on. No, that should. Uh, yeah, headache. One of the worst headaches that lasted god knows how long about a week but i was um on instagram last night chatting to everybody just saying that we were making a new vlog and stuff because i was getting messages being like are you are you done um and it seems like everybody seems like everybody was taken down there was something going on by this new whatever it there is there was something going on yeah seems like everybody's had it but I've got to be honest. It's so in in hindsight, it's um it's been I've had a really really nice week not feeling. Yeah, we started really to awful. Started to feel much better this week. I've been excited to vlog. Yeah. I've been excited to have a haircut and yeah. have a shower. <laughs> I still managed to shower through it, by all this. Oh, what's the point? I always think it makes you feel better if you go for a shower and go out and get a wee bit of fresh air. There was a couple of times where we did try and take Paisley out for a walk and we just had to sort of turn and come back, didn't we? It was not, and it we wasn't going ourselves. well. Yeah. But it's Saturday. Saturday! It sure is. Tonight, I'm on television. Oh God. I'm on Mastermind. Give it up, man! Uh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the world's saying. Nifty The whole world is saying, stop. We don't want you on television. I thought we'd made that clear. Yeah, mastermind tonight. Yeah. How do you do? Mm. Well, I can say now. Yeah. Because it's gone out before people would have seen this. Not very well. Um, what do you think you think going on something called mastermind? I know, ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I just thought it'd be a bit of fun. <laughs> And it, no, it was, was fun. Um, it was sort of fun, but also quite intense and quite serious. <laughs> um, um, but it was, um, you know, I've just years ago again. I think I've said this before. Yeah. Years ago, I would never have done something like this. You were a big no person. Yeah. You said, James said no to everything. Yeah. Talking amongst friends. Think about when you know the In Between Us films had came out and all that sort of stuff. Like how. Mm much stuff you got asked to do. Yeah. He said no to everything. I don't know why, yeah. I'm just a, just, I guess I'm a different person. I'm older. You don't like take I yourself say, as seriously You don't take, you start, I think during your twenties, you really sort of, you're serious, you, you're ready for business. Then you yeah. start getting a bit older and you just go, what's all the fuss about? Yeah. And then you start to think about death. <laughs> and then you think, might as well just have a laugh while I'm here. Why am I taking everything so seriously all the time? Death why am I taking taxis. Se- why am I taking myself so seriously? That's what you shouldn't do. But I do regret not doing some stuff. Some of the things that were offered, like, would have been so much fun. Yeah. Incredible adventures all exactly. over the world. But yeah, it that is true. You regret the things in life that you don't, don't do. do. Yeah. I was worried about looking like an idiot, and then I just thought. <laughs> what? Everyone knows you're an idiot. Everyone knows you're an idiot already. Why are you worried about looking like an idiot? Um, but yeah, I do look like an idiot on Mastermind, that's yeah. for sure. Um, I'm saying yeah. I've not even watched yeah. it. Yeah. 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 The advice I was given from the producers, because obviously I was talking to the producers, producers and <coughs> they said, do you want our advice? I said, well, because that's what I said. I said, look, I'm an idiot. I'm not going to get any of these questions. I'm going to look really The general on knowledge. Bit. Yeah, absolutely. Of course, yeah. I don't have any knowledge at all. And, well, um, in general. Yeah. And um, they said, well, here's some advice. 
If you don't know the answer, try and say something funny. Uh, and of course you have to answer because you get penalised for passes. So you have to say something. You can't... Uh. You can't say pass. You're, well, you can, but you're better to not, you're better, you're better, not, to, give you're better to give an answer. So there's a couple of... Because why? Explain that. Because if there's a situation where it's a tie, yeah. the person who passed more loses. Loses, yeah. So you just said once. So I said, I was just trying to be funny with some stuff, but I'm worried that people will think <laughs> that I actually right. thought that was the answer. <laughs> Why have you done some mental ones? Some, yeah, a couple of silly answers. Um, I'm looking forward to watching it. But it was, uh, but I, I mean, don't get me wrong, I didn't know the answer. I was, you know, I, I, I'm an but idiot. But you didn't think. But I didn't think that was the answer. <laughs> like, a couple of them that I said. I feel like James is trying to cover himself here. But yeah, no, I don't win. <laughs> That's for sure. Um, oh, I want to quickly say, over Christmas, I was getting loads of messages on my Instagram from people who. Oh, we've all got to sit and listen to you and your mastermind. Yeah. But I'm not allowed to say anything. Come on, tell us what's going on in your little life. <laughs> <laughs> so rude. <laughs> this involves you as well. Yeah. Well then, now, okay, I'm listening now. Um, over Christmas I got loads of messages for people um, who either got the book or the t-shirt or both um, for Christmas and it was, it was just yeah. so, it was crazy to see people on Christmas morning opening something with your face on it or a yeah. little t-shirt or something so I just want to say thank you to everybody who bought somebody something or bought themselves something for Christmas and yeah it's really exciting like it's really really it was fun. weird we were in Scotland for Christmas this year we all went to my brother's um for Christmas dinner and obviously there was a, a load of us there and I was like showing my sister-in-law and my mom and my sister and stuff just like the pictures that people were sending and they were just like that's nuts it is yeah you shouldn't think about it that's too much. mental but anyway i just wanted to really say thank you and thank you to everybody who sent the pictures i know i didn't reply to a lot of them obviously because it was christmas day but i did see them um so thank you if you got it or you bought it you can still buy a t-shirt you can still buy the book whatever you can still buy both so saturday nice chilled out day oh something um has come into our lives oh which has um which has improved the marriage so much yeah a lot of people have mentioned this a lot of people have been shocked that people, we haven't had yeah it. a lot of people are like why haven't you got that why haven't you got that um john and claire bought us a perfect draft for christmas which is very um generous yeah um so made your gift look like yeah, yeah. And the worst thing about being ill was the fact that we it's couldn't because, yeah, I was we couldn't at, use I was, the perfect honestly, draft. I was, I was so staring excited. at it for ages. The last thing I wanted was a beer. The last <laughs> thing I wanted was anything to eat. Like, <coughs> I was in that mode. We've um, not had a curry for a long time. But this last... Apart from last night. This last week... It started Monday and I was like... What started Monday? Me feeling better. Oh, right. And yeah. a sort of regime of... Um, because Back to normal. And uh, I was like, oh, just going to do Friday, Saturday, Sunday for beer. Yeah. Just going to do that. We're doing um, the whole, you know, new year, new me. Got to say, I haven't stuck to that at all whatsoever. I'm drinking more beer than ever. Because? Because the Perfect Draft is so fun. <laughs> and can I recommend Stella Unfiltered out of the Perfect Draft? Oh. Can you? Uh, chef's kiss. I can. Absolutely brilliant. Superb. So you'll probably see that in a second. I'm probably going to make myself. I think we should cut to. Let's do that. So we're keeping it in the utility room. Got my little badges for it. And then if we put normal Stella in there, I've got badges for that as well. <laughs> happy really, with that. Really happy with that, yeah. <laughs> How are you at pouring though? Yeah, it's the perfect draft. Very posh, isn't it? It's very posh. But sort of not. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's us, isn't it? Posh in a scummy way. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I tell you what, it's so difficult to find genuine 
stellar glasses. Yeah. I'm just gonna say that. But I've been wanting to like buy a couple more anyway. I know. It's... Cannot get them. Oh, there's the pea dog there playing with her new little Santa toy that Santa brought her. She's also ripped her bed, which is annoying, but luckily Santa bought her a new one, so. That's so nice. Can I try it? Yeah. Oh, I tell you. Give me a bit. <laughs> Where are you going? Go, I'm going to the living room, sit down for a bit. Oh yeah. All right. Oh, what's happening? Oh, we can't watch telly with the big light on. Well, then we can't vlog it. It must be. We need to have light. The whole family's here. Say hello, boys. Hello. We have got... Harrison. And... Jude. And we're going to sit down. And Dad is going to hate every second of this. But we're going to watch... Um, going to watch Dad's Mastermind episode. <laughs> James hates this. Oh, I just don't know why we're all sitting together watching this. Bang! <laughs> 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 Hello and welcome to Celebrity Mastermind with me, Clive Murray. James Buckley, who played Jay in the classic sitcom The In Between Us. His special subject, the BBC comedy series, The Office. <laughs> you could have smiled, James. And our final contender, please. <laughs> Why does this so funny? <laughs> hey, James Buckley. Your occupation? Actor. Actor <laughs> charity? Uh, help for heroes. And your specialist subject? The office. That introduced the You weren't sure about an actor there, were you? Oh. It's, been <laughs> it's been a long time since I've <laughs> done any acting. Swindon. Yes, the job title of which member of staff at Wernham Hog is assistant to the regional manager and not, as he claims, assistant regional manager. Gareth Keenan. Yes. When the seventh annual Wernham Hog office quiz goes to a tie break, what's the sales rep Chris Finch's first answer to the question about which Shakespeare play features the character Caliban? Macbeth. Yes, Brent uses his redundancy settlement to record and release a cover of the song If You Don't Know Me By Now on his own record label. What's the name of the label? Juxtaposition Records. It is. Juxtaposition Records. Is that where it falls apart? It's where it all... <laughs> oh, I'm rabble with him. <laughs> Alright, general knowledge. Finally, let's have James again, please. In between us. Cult classic, three series, two films, box office smash. Still relating. What's the enduring appeal? I guess it's the realism of it. Mm. Um, we know young men, especially, are idiots. <laughs> And um, old men too. Yeah, well, that's the thing. So men in general, young stupid men grow up to be old stupid men, don't they? <laughs> uh, so you're either someone that can relate to that, or someone that enjoys laughing at that. Do people see you in the street and say, "Jay"? Not as polite as that. No, there's, there's, a, there's a couple of other things. <laughs> oh, that's a shout, mate. Uh, but it's all good fun. The stage comedy, which opened in London's West End in 2014, about the hapless attempts by the fictitious Cornley Polytechnic Drama Society to stage a 1920s murder mystery, is entitled "The Play That What Sucked." <laughs> Where it goes wrong. Gaggle is a collective term for what birds? Geese. Yes. It's which country? Finished second in the medals table with 38 golds, one behind the United States. China? Yes, the fast-running herbivorous mammal thought to have been introduced to Britain by the Romans, or even earlier, that nests in a shallow depression in the earth known as a form, is called the brown what? Beaver. No, hair. Which metallic element has the chemical symbol CR? Kryptonite. <laughs> no, chromium. Which American r and singer who first topped the UK singles chart? Oh, wow. jeez. <laughs> Those questions were so hard. They were quite hard. Well, they're harder than everybody else's. You made the guy Probably not. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Enjoy third place with 14 points each. Victoria Smurfit and James Buckley. In Join last. Join third. Anyway, which means in first Join place last. with 18 points, it's Rhea Lena. There you go, that was me on Mastermind. That was funny. We all you, made, you made the guy laugh. Yeah, you kept making him laugh. I don't think you're supposed to do that. 
Kryptonite. Yeah. is the best yeah. medicine? The play I that am. sucks. Yeah. Uh, you got to say something. I am, and I'll be. Oh, I, let me know in the comments. Do you know your periodic table? I remember them mentioning the periodic table, no, I don't. and then being posters of the periodic table at school. I did not for a second. What was the answer? Chromium, 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 or cro chromium? CR, chromium. Right. See, I feel like you should know it now, because you got it wrong on Mastermind. Mm. Well. You still don't care. Still don't care. <laughs> I don't care about the periodic table. And you can quote me on that. <laughs> this has lost all our uh, science subscribers. None of these are No, they don't. They're sat there going, you're not a scientist. They're all sat, a scientist. They're all sat there going, yeah, I didn't know what it was. Anyway. <laughs> Why would you? Anyway, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my beer and maybe be sick a little bit. Oh, Christ. Should we pick this up tomorrow? Might pick it up on Monday. Yeah, tomorrow, Sunday's just um, homework, school clothes yeah. washing. This is boring even for us. The boys have got homework on the periodic table this week. <laughs> I've told him to just write, I don't care. <laughs> right, we'll see you in a bit. James! It was right over! James has got his hood up because his hair's a mess. <laughs> <coughs> I was wearing a woolly hat doing the school run. Shock. So we're filling up the. What's it called? Perfect draft. Perfect draft, draft yeah. Put a new keg in. I've got to send the, uh, the kegs kegs back. Yeah, they like recycle them, didn't they? I think they reuse them, yeah, so. So this does that for a little while, for about five minutes or so. And then it's ready to rock and, and roll. Go. I'll put that keg in the ga in the fridge in the garage so it's nice and cold already. Monday, this is where we're at. Monday has been a busy day for us. Mm -hmm. we had, uh, we've had a couple of meetings each. Um, oh yeah. Mm, no. oh. Yeah, you sit tight. You wait. <laughs> You're not gonna believe you it. You are gonna be <laughs> shook. <laughs> you are. Um, we had a couple of meetings each today. I was doing some video games on the internet and Twitch. Uh, on Twitch. You're streaming on Twitch. Yeah. You said that wins. Yeah, and uh, you've um, got the biggest white head on your neck. Have you seen uh, it? No, I haven't. Ooh. I had no idea. Yeah. It's because um, it's because I've shaved. Oh lord, that. That needs oh, Christ. popping. Oh. Claire just thought, oh, I'll vlog you changing your, your keg. Yeah, it took a lot less time than I thought it was. Oh, it's really easy. I thought it was. Really easy. Just, I'd recommend it, the perfect draft. Dangerous. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Dangerous. I'm, I'm, I, 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 Monday night and you're having a beer. I know. It's, and honestly... I'm not. I actually don't feel very No, good. well, fine, don't have one. Um, but we were like, a couple of weeks ago, we were like, right, no more like end of the day beer. Mm. Don't get me wrong, we're not <laughs> getting Where? sloshed. No, it's a beer. It's a beer with dinner. Yeah, which I mean, isn't good to have a beer every night. It's thought, so oh, fattening. Save a save your beer for Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, we're afraid to start really. Drinking more than ever. <laughs> <laughs> new year, new you. New we're putting year, more new effort year. in. Exactly. So People you know. People are like, oh, I shouldn't drink as much. No, drink more. <laughs> Really see how far you can take it. <laughs> that can't go in. No, that's all for advice, isn't it? You see might. you in the morning. We'll see you in the morning tomorrow. Love you. Night. Oh, morning. Morning, morning, morning. It is cold. Tuesday morning, it's about minus four in the car. That's what he was saying in the car. Me and Paisley are just out on a walk. We just come across this. And I think it would be daft not to try and walk across it. Little frozen sort of big massive puddle. Let's see what happens. Oh, <laughs> don't pull me! Don't pull me! Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh, shit. I'm stuck in the middle of it now. Christ! Yeah, no, it's it's not holding my weight. Look at it. It's well good. Yeah, it's properly cold. Come on, Paisley, I wanna walk I wanna walk on the <laughs> I wanna walk on the ice a bit more. Look at that. You go skating. <laughs> Don't know if you know this about ice, uh, but it can be quite slippery. 
Anyway, that was fun. That amused me for about a minute and a half. Uh, yeah, me and Paisley were on the walk. Four miles, 3.9 something if you want to be pedantic. Not sure I'm going to vlog this walk so much because I have to take my hand out my glove. I had to borrow Claire's gloves because uh, it is hurting my hand having my uh, having holding the camera here. Little vlog update for you. It's cold. There's ice. We're on a walk, and we're going to be doing this for the next four miles. Good morning. It is Tuesday and I just got a food shop delivered. James is out walking Paisley. It is freezing. The temperature has just dropped over the past couple of days, but I kind of like it. I need to clear out this fridge. It's got, it's like old gravy. I want to get these prawns are out of date. Oh, dang it, they're out of date. I'm supposed to have them for lunch one day. Right, I'm gonna get this fridge organized. I'm gonna get all this shopping put away. And then we got a little meeting about something quite exciting. Which we'll tell you about. buy two loaves at a time, put one in the freezer because just with packed lunches and stuff we run out of bread really quickly. Rather than one Wednesday night you're like you go to make sandwiches and you're like oh don't have any bread. Take it out the freezer and it'll be ready in the morning. Fridge done. Oh, Tuesday evening. Yeah, it's dark here. Tuesday right? evening, super dark. Um, our plans have been about. Our plans have gone out the window. They've been scuppered. They've been scuppered. We wanted to do a... Uh... <laughs> Blow! I wanted to stick a little ham on the... We were trying to finish... We were trying to finish strong for you on the first vlog back where we're going to bring back the barbecue. I wanted to stick a ham on the Traeger, but it's a bit of a, for one reason or another, um, it's, a, it's a late evening for us. It's five o'clock already and um, it, the, the ham's going to take apparently up to two hours to do on the, and these kids aren't going to wait until seven o'clock to get their dinner. No. And this boy's not going to wait until seven o'clock to... No. Do his dinner. We need to do that on a day where it's not as crazy with well, different bits and bobs. We can do it tomorrow, but obviously it won't make it in time for this week's vlog. Yeah. So it should be in next week's vlog. It's always good to keep people. This vlog I've been editing today, and this vlog's really boring. Yeah. Well, it's just us on the couch. Then we make it into the kitchen for a beer, and then we're back on the couch. We're boring people. <laughs> we are. That's all we've done this week. <laughs> so. We'll uh, we'll be back next week. We've got we're actually doing some stuff next week. I mean, we've got to go into London for a couple of meetings and stuff like that. I'm sure we'll take yeah. a camera with us and things. Um, but I'd, you know, that's just as boring True. as us sitting on a couch. Maybe we should so try and do some. Maybe we should try and do something. We did. We went for a phase where we tried to do stuff, and people were like, "Why? They hated it. Why is <laughs> we just like it when you're sitting on the couch?" And yeah. that suits us absolutely fine. <laughs> if you prefer it, we prefer it. <laughs> Um, but but yeah. barbecue next week. We're gonna we'll, we'll put our hats and scarves on and go out and have a buckley it's barbecue. It's so cold, by the way. I'm, actually, I'm genuinely worried because I was thinking I don't even know if the barbecue will come up to temperature. Well, it's below freezing outside. We'll find it together. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this week. It's really good to be back. Um, we're really excited about 2023. We hope you are too. Have you got any plans? What are you up to? Let us know in the comments. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. Give the video a thumbs up, that always helps. Oh, and uh, we'll be back with more of this <laughs> next week. Say bye, Claire. Bye, Claire. Don't forget to tell them.
Bon. Stay scummy. <laughs>